Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do a quick reading. So this is a reading, of course, about love, but I've broken it down into the four signs. So we've got water here, we've got air, we've got earth, and we've got fire. So we're going to pull two cards in regards to whomever you're dealing with. Um, or whatever uh, element you're dealing with of uh, earth, water, fire, or air. Um, okay, so let's get started. I have shuffled the cards off camera. Thank you to those who are returning. Welcome to those who are new. Thank you to those who have liked, shared, commented, subscribed to the channel. Make sure you comment below. Automatically enters you to win a free reading. Good luck. All right. Let's get started. Two cards for Aries dealing with water signs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Where are we getting seven of wands and the nine of swords. All right. So someone is, someone has their defenses up in regards to this relationship. It could be you, Aries. Um, you're all up in your head about this. You don't know if this can work. Um, you don't know if you want to walk away from a situation, walk away from a relationship. Um, or the person that you're dealing with, Aries, doesn't they feel this way. There's heavy anxiety in regards to a, a particular relationship, either surrounding you or someone's already partnered here. Um, the anxiety is coming from the fact that um, they would have to... Um, you know, leave a situation. They have to do the Ten of Swords, the ultimate betrayal because they're someone else. Uh, that could be you. It looks like Aries might be standing their ground on something, putting their foot down, giving an ultimatum about someone or something. That's in dealing with Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Two cards for Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Two cards for Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Right. What we got? Eight of wands, six of wands. Nice. All right. So if you're dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising, Aries, it looks like um, there's communication. In uh, you're getting the recognition, the um, the attention that you want. Uh, things are going your way here with uh, a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius person. Um, you guys may be talking about there might you know be messages of love there might even be messages about someone being already in a relationship but there's trouble there's drama uh, due to jealousy and or greed um, they may be talking about uh, moving away from um, which in turn will give you some victory here with the six of wands so I think things are going your way with Gemini Libra Aquarius all right, Aries dealing with Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Wow, These two cards popped out. The Sun in reverse, the Four of Pentacles in reverse. I don't read reversals, but these came out reversed. Um, yeah, uh, something's coming. Someone's letting. Someone's pregnant. Um, somebody's pregnant. They feel alone here. Somebody's pregnant. Um, okay, yeah, this is not a positive pregnancy. There might have been... Um, someone is... Uh, just releasing and letting out how they feel. This could be the Capricorn Virgo Taurus. It's not positive um, information, not you know from you, not coming from the Capricorn Virgo Taurus to you. The sun is here. Um, it's stagnating the energy of um, of illumination, of positivity, of things moving forward, of uh, of clarity. Someone's really talking about how they feel about maybe a pregnancy. Uh, they're not happy about it. They're not happy about it. Or, or there's a pregnancy scare. They're just not 
happy about it. They're, they weren't holding on to their emotions about this. But now they're letting it out. Like, you know, this is not what I want. This is not positive. Okay. Those Aries dealing with other fire signs like yourself, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Two cards. Two of wands. Three cards came out. The Magician and the Queen of Pentacles. The bottom of the deck, Nine of Wands. Looks like Aries has been going through a lot in all situations. Um, contemplating jumping back into something also. Contemplating the drama. Removing yourself. Um, but then contemplating getting back into something with someone else. Maybe with a fire sign. It looks like there is... Um, opposition here uh, in the way of making a decision to actively move away from a situation but you're trying to manifest whatever it is you want here because you are looking at money or if you're dealing with a fire sign they're worried about stability um, they're worried about their money you're worried about money you're worried about stability I, I think the only thing that brings you two together is the fact that you're both worried about the tangible, the pentacle, the money, the stability of oneself first and then the coming together and maintaining or establishing stability. But it looks like someone has to move away from first, move away from whatever it is. There might be an actual move and they're trying to like put it together. If you're dealing with another fire sign, you're like trying to, it may even be trying to move in together. You're trying to see what life is like. And creating something together mm. if this resonates with you please request a personal reading uh, all of my information is below um, make sure you're commenting below take advantage of that two question $20 reading send me an email go over to the website and book that reading there uh, follow me on Instagram insta go all of that information is below Remember, Aries, when in doubt, pray. I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.